Jesus once asked, What good is it for a man to gain the whole world, yet forfeit his soul? There's a story about Benjamin Franklin, one of the founding fathers of the United States. And he tells of this story about his childhood to a friend of his in a letter. And he wrote this. When I was a child of seven years old, my friends on a holiday filled my little pocket with halfpence. I went, I went directly, directly to, a to a shop where they sold toys for children and, being charmed with the sound of a whistle that I met, by the way, in the hands of another boy, I voluntarily offered and gave all my money for it. Hello, that sounds good. Is that your whistle? Yeah, why? Where can I buy one like that? I've got some money. You've got some money, eh? Well, I'll sell this to you if you like. Would this be enough? Uh, just about. I'm doing you a favour. Oh, please. Okay then. Thanks. Oh, I've got the whistle! Now Benjamin goes on to write that when he got back home, his brother's sister's cousins laughed at him so much for giving all his money to buy a whistle. Benjamin got upset, he ran off crying. But from that day on, he taught Benjamin a lesson. Whenever he was going to buy or do something, he always asked himself the question, am I paying too much for this whistle? I think that's a good question we need to ask ourselves. It's so easy to chase after the things we think are important, but aren't really in the long run. Like a man who spends his evenings working later and longer into the night, but failing to weigh up the cost to those closest to him. It's maybe that he misses his children growing up, or he notices his wife is like a stranger who shares the same bed, and then one day he realises, somewhere along the line, He's lost part of his soul in this whole pursuit. Perhaps some point you may have felt you had to lie about something, even though you knew you were only doing it to save yourself, and someone else would pay the price. You live with a fear, wondering if you'll ever be found out, and that guilt stays with you day and night. Jesus understood all this when he asked, what good will it be for man if he gains the whole world, yet forfeits his soul? You know, Jesus challenges all our priorities when he tells us to let go of the world and trust him. So what's the whistle in your life? 